today I'm back uh, about packaging I bought them because I honestly have zero Christmas socks until now and when Emily saw them in the <clears throat> shopping basket she was like yeah you got me socks I'm like uh, nope those are for video <laughs> she wasn't impressed the idea is to somehow decorate our bottle because many of us is giving vodkas, wines, in general alcohol as a gift and I think just a, a paper bag, hmm, you know what, we could do better than that I think. Mm, let me put aside those things that we won't need right now. What we will need is a pair of socks. Now, you have to know that this is not my original idea or anything. This is something common on intern and internet, I think. I've seen it somewhere and I figured I have to try it because if I won't try it, I simply won't know whether it's good or just rubbish or Pinterest oftentimes gives us those amazing ideas, but technically, you know, when you start doing them, they're just not that pretty not that interesting after all or we don't have exactly materials but anyway the idea is to cover up with this sock this beautiful this not not so beautiful bottle that's very pretty Christmassy isn't it now and it's a like the same you paying for a paper bag you paying whatever what like a dollar or two for a paper bag you can as well pay for a sock a pair of sock and technically you have two socks look how cute is actually that now i think you can seriously leave it as it is you don't have to do anything with that or you can cut it the bottom i've seen that people are cutting the bottom but you know what i really don't mind leaving this as it is and maybe add something on top mm, i'm thinking to add some beautiful gold ribbon and i also have this hay so a pack of hay <laughs> so i'm gonna grab some and decorate the top with it okay so let's see I have some hay now I'm gonna put that on on the um, like that so you you won't see that well but <laughs> it's easier for me so I'm just basically covering up the top part and just uh, doing like a bow or I'm not sure how to say it a bow or just a, a, t uh, a knot a knot Yes, that's what I meant. So, that's what we have right now. I think that looks pretty nice all, all, all already. But with a little touch of gold ribbon, I think this will be super awesome. So let's see if I can just do it like this. And maybe do it like this. And I really believe this is looking so much better than you can make it uh, the, the the bow maybe on the side and stick it and glue it or something I think I have this too short so I make that I need to make that maybe a little bit longer mm-hmm there we go uh -huh. and let me try it try to do it once more I just think that when you make things by yourself and um, there is so many beautiful things in in the shops, of course, but when you make things by yourself, I mean, that's definitely, uh, it's counting more, I think. It's so much personal and very pretty. So, let me just, let me just show you. It looks like that for now, but let me just cut the, cut the, <clears throat> that's how I do the cutting. Let me show you from close. I'm, cl I'm holding that in half. And when this is halved, I'm going either, oops, sorry, I'm going either this direction or opposite this direction. So I'm going opposite because, oh, there we go. And then you have this lovely design. So same for this side. I'm going to do exactly the same. Let me just, there we go. And that's what we have let me show you from close our reindeer <laughs> packaging I'm gonna cut those uh, too much of a hay a little bit let me cut that and um, it's nice to pack those things in the video because I can give them I just hope that recipients will never watch my videos <laughs> 
Um, you may think that sock, honestly, I think it's if you have a good sense of humor, friends or family, they'll definitely understand. Now, my reindeer had this nose, I, you didn't see it, but if, if your design doesn't have, like this for example, Santi doesn't have a standing out nose, I'm gonna definitely attach this one from the Pomponi. So, look. I think it's super inexpensive, really pretty, pretty looking. Now this is moving a little bit, so I think I will stick some a tiny bit of hot glue. Uh, but you know what? Definitely looking much more Christmassy and festive uh, when we do it like that. It's a sock. You have one more to decorate, one more bottle. How fun! Inexpensive, easy, and effective. Then let's try with sock number two. <laughs> Maybe I was lucky and it looked so pretty because of the sock. Let's see. Let's see. Maybe this one we're gonna have to cut it. I don't know. Maybe the bottle shouldn't be too big. We'll we'll see. Oops. Let me just put that on. Ah, that's so cute as well. Look at that, guys. You must admit this is so cute looking. It is. It. <laughs> Honestly, it is. So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do exactly the same thing, but I don't think we need the, the grassy stuff. I'm just gonna, I just add this huge red nose. Will I add red or will I add green? No. Will I add, no, Marta, don't make it complicated. Just add the red nose and it will be fine. So I'm adding some red nose with my hot glue. I think it's just awesome. Now pomponis, those pomponis, you can get them in any craft store, honestly, especially Christmas time and especially for kids because this is really for kiddos and uh, the, the, those pomponis are really for kiddos art. So that we ha what we have now. I like the idea maybe to add the white one as well here on his hat kind of. Why not? Why not? Now be careful with the hot glue gun because you may burn yourself. Okay, so that's what we have. We need to do something about the top part to close it down. What I did is I just kind of, instead of holding it like this, I just roll it down a little bit so you can be a little cr cr creative maybe. So this is what we have right now. I think it's super cute. And I found this green um, left over. <laughs> um, either I'm gonna add it here or, which is here, <coughs> Let me show you so you can see it closer. I can quickly just make a quick bow. So either I'm going to add it <clears throat> on the top of my bottle or maybe I'll just do it where the hat is. Uh, no, no, maybe not. Let's see if I'll add it where the, where the cute hat is. Hmm. I pick green because <laughs> my bottle is green. So maybe that's a little tip for yourself. I think I can add it there. Oh. I think that's much nicer now. Let me just make this bow super pretty. There we go. Okay, I like that. Maybe a little smaller, a little smaller, pull it back, pull it back, pull it back. What if I make one more bow from those two long lines? There we go. We can certainly have two bows now. I like that. There we go. So green matches beautifully our bottle and our Santi. Let, you can also oops, cut it the same way as I've done in the previous one. Or just go like this only. You can't see. Or you will see on here like this. And the other one as well which is a little shorter but I still managed so that's what we have let me show you them two together that's what we have I really enjoyed making those and this one uh, it's already on my youtube channel so you have to check it out little gnomes uh, tiny gnomes uh, for as a topper for a bottle you have to check them out how I make them I will give you a link at the end of uh, this video thank you so much for watching as always I hope this was inspirational fun uh, something different for you to try thank you so much and I'll talk to you very soon bye